All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Mixtape Show. It is time for the Artist of the Week interview. And this week's Artist of the Week interview is brought to you by Mix Mafia DJ. Shout out to my Mix Mafia DJ's family, man. And calling in, man, we got the brothers, got some, got some joints that's been blazing here in the station here recently. And it's a pleasure to talk to him, man. He goes by the name of Busy Bailey, man. What's good, sir? How are you doing tonight? Yeah, how you doing, man? Chilling, 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 man. So busy Bailey, man. Like I said, we've been playing your records here the past couple weeks, and uh Ange sent these joints over last week. And so we uh tested the out the, these two joints I got, this heavyweight and this disrespect. And um, before we get into those real quick, man, if you don't mind telling the listeners, man, you know, just kind of born and raised, and and um, you know, what got what got you into the music thing, man? Okay. Yeah, um, I'm born born and raised in Charlotte, North Carolina. Well, you know, so half my family, Salisbury. The other half, Charlotte, and uh, you know, just bounced around, but just Winston Salem, North Carolina. I mean, <laughs> Winston Salem, Salisbury, and Charlotte, and uh, so that's the generalized area where I bounced back and forth. Um, getting into music, um, I think I remember when I was a little kid, um, I had like this boombox, and uh, I, I would sneak and listen to the music whenever it was bedtime, mm-hmm. and so um, and what. And, what I would do was, is uh, so when I had sleep, I would turn it all the way down, but it still recorded the radio on a blank tape. So I would press the recorder. And then uh, I heard my mom, one day I came and listened to it because I, I hated the commercial. So I would fast forward past the commercial just to listen to the music on the radio when I recorded it. So I heard my mom yelling in the background. I'm trying to figure out like, like where, where did, like, where is this? How is she on here? You know what I'm saying? So <laughs> I found out. Uh, that in the left the left side of my headphones, if I rapped into them or if I talked into them, then I could put my voice on the tape over mm-hmm. the music. So there we go. Now now I'm I'm pretending like I'm the DJ, and then then after that, then I started I started freestyling over the over the words, like you know, just doing it myself. And I think that's what what got me interested into it. Oh, 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 using the analog the ways. Uh, anyway, you're using the analog ways to create yeah, a digital sound, crazy. right? <laughs> dope man dope man yeah i was and like who, i was who's, like who's, six years old who, who are some of the artists that you that you studied and, and really you know tapped into coming up um it was uh biggie smalls jay-z um wayne i listened to a listened to a lot of wayne uh, in my teenage years and um you know i just kind of just kind of take from everybody um everybody yeah, and explain to me that, that that North Carolina man, you guys are a hotbed right now. I've been hearing um, it's kind of like the new Atlanta, basically, as far as the the, the talent that's coming out of there right now. How, how would you describe that? Just North Carolina right now, putting on right now. Uh, it's like uh, it's like like meat in a slow cooker, I guess. It's like it's, it's been a long time. Like you know, it seemed like this North Carolina got looked over all the time, you know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? So uh, that's that's kind of how I describe it, like me in a slow cook. Yeah. It's tender now, it's ready. <laughs> are you are you proud that you're kind of one of the front runners right now that's that's putting on for the for the for the county for the city and everything? I mean, um it's it's just something I always seen myself as since I was younger. I wanted to be first, but mm. you know, that didn't happen. It's okay mm-hmm. though. Yeah. Hey, man, it's not it's not wrong. Hey, I, I heard somebody say I heard somebody say the other day, they was like, you know, it's cool not being first, but it's nothing wrong with saying I'm next. You know what I mean? <laughs> definitely. Definitely. Right, so right. we got these two right. new joints, uh, heavyweight and, and disrespect. Are they a part of a is that a part of an EP or an album that you're working on right now? Well, disrespect was on the album. Disrespect was on the album called Crown that is that's unreleased. Um, OK. With uh, but but with the other song, that's that's just like a single. I haven't really placed it yet. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Don't, don't, don't. And how, how would you describe your sound if, you, if somebody was asking you, you know, what is what is Busy Bailey's sound? How would you give them a quick little breakdown of what you think your sound is? Uh, I would I would say, um, it sound it sound like I, I watch TV on mute. Mm. <laughs> that's what i would mm. say it sounds mm. like i watch tv on mute <laughs> i hear that brother i hear that man and um i know COVID's kind of been 
COVID's kind of been a problem for a lot of artists right now, as far as moving around and and kind of getting getting their name out there. Well, what, what what do you what's some of the things that you were doing to kind of you know keep keep motivated and and, and moving around with the, with COVID being a situation right now? Well, um, you know, just going to the gym, uh, you know, kicking it with my dogs. Like I said, watching more TV than normal. Uh, you know, still going out fishing, you know, stuff like that, just creative stuff. It, it forced me to sit down and be more creative. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was going to ask, too, is, is it, since you kind of have a little bit more time to be still and steady, has that have been helping the creative part as far as the music making? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, it's, 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 made, it's, it's feel like um, I'm in, it feel like I'm in high school and just picked the pencil up again. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's it's just a lot of lot of passion into it now so yeah i'm I'm, yeah. Having, I'm, I'm I'm enjoying it yeah yeah like i said this is i think this situation has definitely showed a lot of people who who the real hustlers are and this who can really you know now that we don't have these distractions anymore you kind of got to focus on one or two real things to do to, to, to really advance so this is definitely making um a lot of people show who they really are you know what i mean Definitely, definitely, man. So I'll tell you what, man, what, what else you got, man? What's some other goals you got for this year that you want to knock out? Uh, we'll say Absolutely. once everything um, clears up a little bit, what's some of the things you want to definitely accomplish? Um, as far as, as what again? And, and as far as the music thing, once everything kind of clears up, what's some, what's some of the goals you want to knock out this year in 2021? Uh, it's really just, I'm just ready to uh, hit the road and, you know, just put my face in different different places. You know what I'm saying? I'm just, I'm really excited for that. Shoot videos. Like I'm, I'm just ready. Yeah. Yeah. And what is a, what is a, what, what is a state, a live show that you put on, man? How, how would you explain that energy if you're doing a live show? Man, my name is Busy Bailey. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm, I'm a, I'm a busy body guy. You know what I'm saying? So. I hear that. I hear that. That's my my I I even I even so I'll tell you what, brother. Social media, man. What's the best way we can we can follow your journey right now? Yeah, you can follow me um, on everything. It's at Busy Bailey. Um, I was frequency for a year and a half, um, but I I went back to my to my original name. So, you know, there for as far as the the platforms of our music, it, it'll be coming there soon within this month. So. But Busy Bailey is everything at Busy yeah. Bailey, B I Z Z Y B A I L E Y. Definitely, definitely, man. Well, I'll tell you what, brother. I'll tell everybody that comes on the show, man. Once once you're on the show, uh, you family, man. We got we got your back. You're an alumni. So anytime anything's popping off, man, just reach out to Ange and let her know you want to come back on and we'll we'll definitely sit down with you and discuss whatever you want to promote, man. So this is definitely home for you, all right. Definitely appreciate that. All right, all right, man. So I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll, we'll get into a couple more. We get into these records after this interview, man. And um, anybody you want to shout out before we get up out of here? Um, I'm shout out. Hi, mom. I got you. Nah, uh, <laughs> you know, shout out um my boys. I uh, shout out and shout out Mix Mafia Radio. Um, you know, as a team. Uh, you know, shout out everybody that's you know that's around me. I don't got to say your name. You know. I hear you, brother. I hear you, man. I'll tell you what, like I said, ladies and gentlemen, he goes by the name of Busy Bailey. He's a now an official alumni here at a mixtape show. You're going to be hearing more from him here on the show. We're going to keep playing these records. And um, whenever you drop those new singles, man, definitely shoot those our way, man. And we got you, man. We're going to break these tracks for you, all right? They're definitely coming, man. All right, Appreciate all right, man. Don't, don't, we'll get into this and we'll be right back.